St. Lucie and this presentation of New York Mets baseball on Pick 11 is the Mets play home over Park. Justin Verlander delivers to Brian Miller and we are underway. Runs. He did walk it off for the Marlins with a sharp single into center field. Walked six, which is some Mets starters in the past. And there goes the, the second time we've seen that this spring on Johnston, one and two. And that's his first strikeout of the afternoon. That time, Verlander gets out of the way. McNeil down to a knee, gets up. He feels as comfortable against lefties as he does. And very, very effective as he grounds this one to short. Outfielder from Havana, Cuba. Little dribbler down to third, and LeBlanc cannot handle it during the offseason. Lindor chopper to third. LeBlanc backs up, second and one. For it, me like hoping you'll protect me. Instincts. 0 2 pitch, and there is a swing and a miss. Like, why waste the time going? <laughs> one and two. You know, that's down to Alonzo at first, steps up. They've got Gonzalez in for the Mets in the bottom of the second inning. All Brexton Garrett. Johnston settles under it, one down. Defense, he's a good base runner if you need it. The 3-2 pitch, grounds one to shortstop. Devers, oh. the game yesterday since coming back from the... Liner right back off Garrett, knocks it down, underhands to get... Down to third. Long throw across the diamond. Ring up 3,000 strikeouts. Category, that's Lindor, ranging, spinning, firing. Verlander behind three and one. And that's up high and is the batter for Miami. Second, McNeil shovels, Lindor fires. And Bardo. Two hopper to shortstop, that's Devers. Open for him to learn a little bit. Into left field, what a terrific play over there by Charles. Over, he's able to like instill some knowledge to McNeil about what and steal the base. He's not that guy. He's at the ability at the plate, like he did right there. Nimmo with a two-out single, single in his first at bat. Down to third, backing up. The block getting waved in as Marte hits is safe at second, and Nimmo here on Francisco Lindor. And that one eats him. Contact when he needs it. Flashed into left field for a base hit for Devers. But scampers back to Fern to open up the home part of the schedule against a quick snap throw down to first, not in time. To help get themselves out of situation. Finds <laughs> one over the glove of Pete Alonzo and into right around third. On his way to third with a stand up working on things more than anything. Canna and Nimmo. It's Johnston tags it doesn't do Jay correct. Yeah, is as good as anybody numbers prove it Jeff McNeil He's as good as anybody Jake Lander again, and it bounces into foul territory just above the left ankle Got some butter Victor Mesa slashes a single into right block Throw is off the mark Jeremy. I can't imagine that uh, is that what is hammered foul To McNeil Plenty of time, and so the was behind the calf and uh, left to get it going for the Mets here in the fourth. We've got some really good options down there, you know, just like we had planned to do, is trying to share the load a little bit. A, a moment like that as a New York Met. Uh, hold on, boys. Yep, Neil. Fuck, how difficult is it, or is it difficult? Lost one into center field, and Mangum is there. Is there anything or any challenges for play in that regard? Um, you know, two and two on Devers. Here's the delivery, and back is Lindor. He can't get there. Big wide turnaround first, and scamp. An attempted stolen base to see his mechanics behind the plate. Looking forward to seeing his mechanics on the throw. Runner takes off the miss, throw down to second. It is in time. Or the inside of the ankle and middle in between Lindor and McNeil or Charles LeBlanc forms on Fridays at home this season. As the Never one of my 11 teams bounced wide at first. The one thing I, I think they were gray middle. Lindor on the right side of the infield. He got sort of a handful of at-bats in the WBC. New field. I've got to go gambling with you tonight, Todd <laughs> Seal.
as a lefty on lefty and to stay through the success. Brandon Nimmo to the left side. That's one, and that is 0-2. Pitch to Martin. That field Miller can only watch it. Then. And he slides in. He runs just enough to be safe. He is a very strong man as Lindor loses the bat. 314 in the Grapefruit League. He's had a very good. He is past shortstop into left field. Racing home. Here's the throw, not in time. Here's the 2 0 pitch on the way. That goes the second baseman in a Hosa. Man of it as the game went on. And now Steven Nagosik, a guy in the most. And if Buck Showalter gets the chance, foul territory for the out to Gomez. De Devers did so in the first inning. Good pitch by Nagosik there. Good frame. Or Eliezer Hernandez as Megum works out a walk. They can have some very effective guys at the back end. Snap throw down to first, gets away over there. 2-2 two -two pitch on the way to Chavez, who swings and barely gets a piece of it. Is it true? Do you guys believe it's Max is talking about? Swing and a miss. Steven Nagosik working us. Over towards the line and against the screen. They paid him some money. He's going to be the guy that goes north. And I think if there was any debate at a long leash, if he continues to struggle. Jeff McNeil bouncing one to the right side. Johnston flipping a rental. He would come back and be a part of this team for this year. Cool. He shakes it off and then comes back and you see he goes right back to that off-speed change here and that was not very good when he was acquired from the bounce to shortstop devers ranging firing good change up able to set it up see something coming in point you can't get the barrel to it with those two cutters then he goes to the change up right there didn't get it where exactly that's with as a professional pleasure to be around and his second strikeout of the inning is john games here Devers, and it's Devers who settles under it. One down. Over 200 strikeouts. It's one on a one hop to second base for the... Yes. 3-2 pitch to Nip. Rounds to shortstop. Devers backs up. Fire. A good changeup. His issue in his season's pass has been BC. Has it measured as he makes his way in, and that's out. Toronto, uh, to be able to drive the ball, drive, make up for some of that offense, they're going to be losing with those two, two or three slot to give him an opportunity to drive in more runs. It was interesting to watch him all that. Into shallow left field. First there, LaCastro a season ago didn't hit for average with the Yankees, but we know about that speed, and he has had a ballpark. Wrist is something that can be very lingering and can be problematic as well. And LaCastro. Who's going to take it? It's the shortstop. Who got a back up, and he runs it down for the second out. Didn't get it. He's hit for Dariel Gomez. So the Mets have a two out. That is a threat. And if he's not a threat, as he hasn't been this to match that fastball. He faces the of the Miami order, and that's Mosquera going down. Pitchers, and you get that flexibility in your shoulder, then the ball slings out. 2006 at 2002 for Bessie. Mosquera 